Welcome everyone to the final episode of Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree. We are about to go face the final boss and I don't think there's much else to say. Um, enjoy the, the struggle, the pain, and the eventual triumph. Hope you guys enjoy! My loyal blade and champion of the festival. Both your deeds will ever be praised in song. Now, the vow will be honored, and my lord brother's soul will return, so that he may be my consort. Is that... Does Radon have a sister? She's big. Oh, she's got lightning and shit. a lot of reach with those swords. That took my everything just to get to this phase. <laughs> Lord brother. You are returned. Tarn 
banished one. Aspiring Lord of the Old Order. If you have known sin, if you grieve for this world, then yield the power forward to us. Do I, Nicola, and my promised consort, Radan. Oh, I thought I was fighting Radan's sister <laughs> or something. Ow, oh, what? Where'd you come from? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what? <laughs> Gonna be here a while. I don't know if we'll be able to beat this tonight. Welcome to statistically the hardest from software boss ever. Oh, great. He has a couple moves that don't feel like they're dodgeable. You never figured out how to dodge the weird gravity pull attack? Yeah, is that's a really weird one. And when he throws the like meteors or whatever. <sighs> oh, 
Okay, let's see if we can see this for more than like five seconds. Nani the fuck? Uh, there's so much light happening. What the hell? Okay, I beat Melania, I can beat him. Maybe. The light show is pretty distracting. Oh my God, what the hell was that? Like, what the hell? Dude, how many moves does he have in this phase? I'm still seeing new shit. Lord of the old order. Oh, more smoochies. What is happening? Oh, <laughs> what is My heart was stolen. <laughs> oh, boy. I got an emote. Yay. <laughs> Which boss was the most difficult for me to defeat? In the base game, Melania. In this game, in the uh, DLC, aside from this, which is probably going to be the toughest. Um, maybe Gaius? What was the hardest? The putrescent knight, I died a lot of times too. Okay, I, I got, I got to the next phase. We're going to die immediately, but it, that was my goal. <laughs> that was the best I could do. God. 
Nicola, can I have a huggy? Can I have a little smoochy poo? I will, I will serve you. Oh God. You know, <laughs> dodging towards him doesn't seem any better than dodging away. What the fuck? <laughs> Please stop. Stop. I don't understand. Dang, I have no idea. I don't I don't I have no idea how to dodge anything in his second phase. Like not one single move. No matter what I try. Are oh, you going to start with that? Okay, you've never done that before, but go off. Dude, what the hell? You don't make any sense. Yep. Yep. It's a frustrating fight. I hope this is a fight that'll get like more fun when I start to get the hang of it a little bit more and kind of understand it at least a little bit. But right now, it's just, it doesn't feel like fun like Putress and Knight did. I have no idea what's happening. I think so. He's probably doing the same move set for more or less. But since there's all these added flashes of light that you also have to dodge, it's hard to even tell which combo he's doing because there's all this other stuff going on. What is this? What the hell? I know I'm coming. Okay, no, I, I can't take a break. I actually have to go. Here we are. Okay, so I was thinking of optimizing my armor i'm not sure if i would want to change my talismans um i have more hp stamina and equipment load i have more hp restoration from flask of crimson tears i have boost maximum hp by the utmost and vastly boost physical damage and negation i'm not sure if i want want to change any of that but maybe i'll get some more physical defense here okay so I could wear this and still medium roll? This is the most damage neg uh, physical damage negation. Ew! Ew! <laughs> Wait. Wait, no! Ew! <laughs> That's disgusting! That's a pretty fast roll. I mean, the medium roll is pretty good, I think. Okay, we'll leave it like that. Let's just get a few. Okay. The physic helps to get through the first round here. A 
Okay, we got to second phase. <sighs> Dang it. you tap real quick and then run away oh my a god i hate this grab so much i don't care i don't care Mikola. shut the hell up nobody cares nobody fucking cares Oh, that move is so bullshit. Ah, oh, fuck. No! You're not supposed to do that there. <laughs> That's not the move you're supposed to do. I'll miss you. A thousand year voyage. I swear to God. By oh my God, there's just light everywhere. I don't know what to do about it. It's so stupid. Why is it so stupid? I keep dying with so many flasks left. Bro, what the hell? What is this? But we keep trying. Damn it. I promise you a thousand year voyage guided by compassion. Don't make promises you can't keep. Oh my god. Jeez. This is... I don't know what to do. I don't understand. The second phase sucks, man. It sucks. This sucks. I thought I'd be making... Uh, any amount of progress by now, but I have made zero. I'm just like, okay, let's try to figure out this second phase, and then I'm just like, bap, 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 dead. <sighs> what are you doing? I'm dead already! Oh my god. Is this when you left the really bad angry review? When you were fighting this guy, Clamp? Yeah? <laughs> oh. I promise you. I'm trying to dodge later because I kept dodging too early, but I'm I'm now I'm too late. It's really I don't know why it's so tough. Oh my goodness. I feel like you have to almost perfect this guy in the second phase. What? I promise you. Hi. I was out of flasks anyways. Let us go together. Okay. I pick this ending. GG. Next game. GG. Next game. No. Oh my god. I promise you. No. I might need some like help. 
I feel like I'm I'm not getting anywhere. I feel like I am not gonna figure this out. No, I yeah, I've been getting to the second phase constantly since almost the first time I fought him. It's the second phase that I can't get. Calm the fuck on. Let me let me learn your moves. I can't. Damn it. No, no advice right now. If we don't beat him tonight, then tomorrow maybe I'll maybe I'll ask for advice. I dodged. Whatever. He has no openings in this phase. You know, when people said, like, he's harder than Melania, I was like, no, they're just, they're just, they're just saying that, that, like, they just, they think so, but it's not true. Like, there's no way, right? I want to play other games. Die. Die so I can play other games. I have a big backlog and I need you to respect the backlog. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I said stop. How do you heal? How do you heal? He just goes forever. I can't do it. I can't do it. All right, we're going to beat this guy tonight. In the next 45... Oh, shit. 40 minutes. <laughs> oh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. I think four, 400 deaths isn't that bad. I saw some other streamers who were at over 400 deaths and they were only halfway through the DLC, so. I can't be too upset about that. <laughs> no, no, not the, oh God. Not the grab, anything but the grab. Chosen to be a complete asshole. Yeah, he's chosen to be a complete and utter asswipe. How can you dodge his sword when the light is... Mi uh, you're like... The <laughs> like I'm over here having a rave and my character is refusing to dodge my character is just like let's go light party woo yeah I definitely do not want help no I don't want 20 people telling me what build they use Thank you. <laughs> That's not that doesn't help. Thank you. Oh. Jeez. Jeez. I feel like we've made a, a minuscule amount 
of progress tonight. bullshit were you aware that you're broken and bullshit i think it's important that you know that shut the fuck up dude Bitch. Fuck you, bitch. Jesus, motherfucking Christ! I promise you. No, let me heal. Let me heal. This fight is so stupid. I'm sorry. All right. Well, Husbando's going to be really pissed, so I better go. But um, tomorrow we can go get mad again. So, yay. Yay. Um, See you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Okay. So, welcome to day two-ish of... Uh, fighting the consort is it consort radon and we have just changed out our hp talisman with the golden braid to give holy damage negation as suggested by some in chat all right the first few runs will be the warm-up runs they're probably not going to be too great Yep, I forgot to drink my physic and then I remembered and it was too late. Okay. Uh Alright. This is how we're doing this today, huh? Voyage guided by compassion. This is this is this is how we're doing this, huh? Dodge away. Ah, shit. Nice. 
guided by compassion. That's that's nice. Thanks. Thanks for that. Lord of the old Again? Order, let us go together. <sighs> that's what, the fifth, sixth time? Death counter is for the DLC. And it might uh it might surpass my death counter for the the base game. <laughs> if things keep going like this. Oh my god, I'm in a wall. Fuck. I've already died more times to Radon than I did to Melania. Oh, these fights must be a lot faster than the Melania fights were. I guess th those were long fights. Because we fought, like, time wise, we barely fought him compared to her. I'm just getting hit by every light possible and I'm getting flinched and I'm getting frustrated about it. This is ridiculous. <sighs> oh my God, stop with the light. Shit. Oh my god. Wow, that damage is crazy. Oh, that damage. Oh man, I had seven flasks left, but I couldn't use them. That's the worst, is having the flasks, but you can't use them. I promise you a thousand year voyage guided by compassion. This is the most annoying thing that I've ever done, like, experienced in my life, is that fucking shit right there. Or that. <laughs> or that. Hello, Charles. What's up? This wall! This wall! This whole fight! This whole fight! You're good? Well, at least one of us is, Charles. At least one of us is. That's great. I'm so happy to hear that. That's good for you. Getting tired of looking at this guy's ugly mug. Not that I can really see it. He's so tall. I'm staring at his crotch the whole time. My controller is getting sweaty. Sorry, guys. The uh, the backlog is on indefinite hiatus for the foreseeable future. Boiled crab. But you don't think I can get that item anymore? Weapon buffs. What are weapon buffs? I don't even know what all these mechanics are, guys. I'm sorry. What I have is what I have. Weapon buffs are the graces. 
I ha I'm using them. Spells? I can't use spells, right? Let me tell you guys, streaming this these games is the most annoying thing in the world. <laughs> I've already changed my talisman. I've changed my armor. I've changed my talisman. I've applied graces. But he can still kill me in one combo. So what's the what's the point? Oh my god. No, I don't. <laughs> it's. <sighs> I just want to learn the fight. That's all. There's no, like, one change that I can do that's going to make me win. I just rather focus on learning the fight. I want to make changes after every fight to my build. No, I'm not leaving and getting anything. Ugh. Okay, how do you dodge those where he's going like this? I don't understand. I can't dodge that fast. Are there only certain ones that hit? They all hit? Why well, can't I try to dodge to the side and it doesn't work either? I feel like I can't progress. Like, I'm not... The last, like, hundred fights, I haven't learned anything new about how to dodge his second phase moves. The last hit does, like, 90% of the damage. But if I'm getting, um... If I'm getting flinched, then I can't properly time the last dodge, can I? I can't dodge that for the life of me. Can't do it. This is my life now, yes. I think you're right, Psycho. We live here now. All of us, all of us together. I was wanting to heal. <laughs> I am needing to heal again. <laughs> oh God. doesn't work. All right. What is he doing? 
Oh my god, what is he doing? Oh, oh no, not this. Is he doing this again? Wait, no, there's different shit! They switch it up again? His moveset better not be changed. I fucking swear. Your moveset better not be fucking changed, you asshole. You know what? Fuck FromSoft. I'm never buying their game again. I am never, ever... He had more up his sleeve. Can you believe it? Can you believe FromSoft would would do something like that? They would never. Oh my goodness. What a crazy, crazy thing to think, huh? They wouldn't like make you kill a monkey and then like it comes back to life. And then like, and then you think you finally killed it and then there's like two later on like they wouldn't do that you know like they're nice people you know oh I promise you a thousand year voyage it's been a while since we've uh done this Mikola. it's been a little bit i missed you boo wall yeah oh, you're great dude i just die instantly how am i supposed to do this how am i supposed to learn You are the most bitch, bitchiest, bitcher, bitchin' asshole motherfucker in the world. I said what I said. I promise. How? You a thousand year voyage guided by compassion. Holy shit! I do just run <laughs> that didn't work Damn it. <laughs> oh man, yeah. Since I don't know how to dodge that properly. All right, well, I have to work tomorrow. I'll see you guys then. Have a good night. Bye bye. I promise.
promise you. We need to stop meeting up like this. Ah! Did you guys see? Dude, my sword went completely through him. That's the second time that's happened. Two times out of like a, a 200 attempts at fighting him is not too bad, but it's still pretty bad. Oh shit. Oh God, we're here already. Okay, where is he? Where is he? Where does he come from? Uh, uh. Oh! Okay. I feel like I can't recover after he oh, Gosh, he just goes crazy after that Can we get out of here? that move. Oh, shit. I never know he's doing it. One mistake is the end of the run. But I think my strategy is working. I'm trying to stay close to him. I'm trying to stay right in front of him so that he will use moves that I know how to dodge better than the ones where he he's far away. I gotta stay right up on that ass. Too far. 
I couldn't get- I need to be right on his toes or else the light's gonna hit me. Of course I would die to the light there. Okay, we gotta get in his ass crack. That's the only way. If we can't smell his ass, we're doing it wrong. wrong button i wanted to heal but i attacked uh, i get i start like panicking when after the uh star fall of meteor attack and i i forget what i'm doing well those blood greases lasted us a long time guess we're just gonna go to the next one down the list i was also toying with the idea of Maybe I'm afraid to have too many things here, but I could use it maybe when he jumps up in the air. The rune arc? I don't know. No heals left. <laughs> Dodge the sword, die to the light. <laughs> Tale as old as time. I was gonna heal <laughs> after I dodged that, but I dodged out again. I have to dodge in. Even if I'm going to heal, I need to get right on his ass. Because the light goes out. On his ass. I had no, I had no chance to hit him. No break! No break until we beat him. He's going down. I just need, at this point, I just need the RNG. Hmm. Okay. Just dodge roll a lot, and usually it kind of works. Ah! 
Oh, he's doing that. That's what happened last time. I almost beat him and then I missed my hit and then... <laughs> I feel like every time I miss that attack, it just, it makes me so mad. Like he has so few openings. That I have to take every, every chance I can get to hit him. Well, that was an okay run that just ended very immediately. He pushed me into the light! Uh, not even half. Guys, I don't know. I, I feel like I've hit a wall. my god! The stun lock! Oh my god. <gasps> I messed up. I didn't know I was out of heals. I messed up. Womp womp. Ah. Uh, we don't cheese here. Sorry. Ever. Never ever. No dairy. Um, the only dairy acceptable is Greek yogurt. Yeah. I just, I'm not, I'm not having enough heals at the end. Can I move on and come back later? Uh, this is the last boss. <laughs> Literally, the end, the run can end that fast. Yeah, I thought quite a few of them were the run, but none of them were the run. strategy here. <laughs>
only there was a way to double my damage. Somehow. I think that'd be enough. We'd be good. That's how you get past that part. much longer than I wanted it to. Oh. Oh. Oh, get fucked. Oh. Uh. Sorry, I feel like I have to wring my hands like I feel like I just have to do this right now. I don't know why. I can't stop. Uh. 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 I streamed for four hours with no breaks. <laughs> Remembrance of Radon, consort of Mikola, hewn into the shadow tree. The power of its namesake can be unblo unlocked by the finger reader, blah, blah, blah. Uh, in there, I can't even read right now. 
In their childhood, Mikola saw in Radon a lord, his strength and his kindness that stood in stark contrast with their afflicted selves. And so Mikola made his heartfelt wish that Radon would one day be his king consort. So what does consort mean exactly? I, I meant to look it up, but I didn't. Was there always a bunch of bodies in the ground? Spouse or lover? Was there was there always a bunch of bodies in the ground? Because I didn't even notice. <laughs> oh look, my nothing. I thought it was a bunch of rocks and like maybe some fabric, but I didn't. I did not even register the. Those are my past lives that have fallen in battle. Yes. Um. Hmm. Should I touch the memory? Oh, circlet of light. The circlet of light which adorned Mikola's head as he returned in divine aspect. It has begun to fade into nothingness. Slightly boosts intelligence, faith, and arcane while also boosting the power of Mikola's light. This circle was to be the very foundation upon which Mikola's age of compassion would be built, should it have ever come to pass. Maybe we should have just let him do his Age of Compassion. Is that it? Is there more? That's it? That's it! We did it! Oh, what's this? Wait, we're not done. Oh, is that Thuli? I didn't even summon you. You still died. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> Why did he die? Okay. Man. I I feel like you know when you finish like a book or a series or like a really long game and you're like damn it's over i feel like that but with that boss fight like i don't know how to be a person that's not fighting radon like i forgot how to live in a world where i have to fight radon <laughs> you know <laughs> what do i do with my life <coughs> like, where do we go from here? The hell is all this? What the hell's going on here? I think that was the best DLC content that I've ever played. It's amazing that the DLC for this game is like a full game, basically. 
I always thought The Witcher 3 DLCs were the best, but um, I think this tops it. I enjoyed how large this DLC was, but I also enjoyed that it wasn't as huge as the base game. I think my main issue with the base game was that it was just too big and too long and it was too too much to explore it was just it felt really overwhelming this was a little bit more manageable there were some really cool areas there were some really cool bosses there were lots of surprises i'm not really sure what else needs to be said the shadow tree leveling system i felt like it worked pretty well I did have help finding a lot of the fragments, so that probably made it a little bit easier for me. If I was going in blind, I probably would have missed a lot of them and it might have been a much more frustrating experience for me. I think there were three bosses that really stood out to me as like my three favorites from this DLC. The first being the putrescent knight. I really loved his design. I loved learning his fight. His moves looked really cool. He just looked really awesome. The arena was really neat. Secondly, I would say Midra. I really, really enjoyed that fight a lot too, even though it was kind of easy compared to some of the other ones. Visually, I loved like his second phase and stuff. I guess Mesmer was really cool too. I mean, Mesmer visually was probably the best. The cutscenes, his move set was awesome. I guess I, I guess I would have to have make it a top four. I gotta put Mesmer in there. I just feel like I didn't really get that satisfaction of really feeling like I got a whole a handle of the boss because I think I got lucky on the run that I beat him on, and then he just kind of died before I figured out how to dodge a lot of his second phase attacks with the snakes and stuff. So. That was a little bit of a letdown, but that's not the fault of of the boss or the game or anything. That's just how things just happen to go. And I can't believe I'm saying this, but I think after everything is said and done, the Consort Radon fight is probably my favorite. Is it because I spent the most time on it? That's probably a big factor. And... I remember being very frustrated and thinking that it was stupid and broken and and really really struggling on that second phase but towards the end I started really getting a handle on it a little bit. I still struggled with a lot of his moves but when I learned to stick close to him and kind of focus on dodging those combos from close range and not to mention like the music, the arena just how he looks and then when Mikola joins in I don't know it was a really great it was a great fight it was a great fight I did fight him post patch nerf uh unfortunately or fortunately I don't know <laughs> it's good and bad you know in different ways so bear that in mind bear that in mind but it still even then took me three and a half days or a little less than three and a half days streams to beat him about maybe 13 12 or 13 hours many more deaths than melania but i got this great sense of satisfaction from finally defeating him and i felt like i really earned that win and that feeling is what really sticks with me with these uh boss fights FromSoft is amazing. I can't believe the quality that they put out over and over and over again. And I can't wait to play whatever they're working on next. Whatever it is, if it's a Souls-like, if it's Armored Core, like I am so there. This was so much fun. I hope you guys had fun. Please let me know what your favorite bosses in this DLC were. And I'll catch you guys in the next playthrough. Until then, take care and goodbye.